Welcome back. This is Arcade Night. And with how Stark finally defeated, we must make the kingly decision on rather to turn north and meet the Wildling Horde in battle or regroup down south. So sit back on your comfy thrones, grab a golden chalice of your favorite tasty beverage as we get ready to play A Clash of Kings, A Throne for Dragons. We still have our army outside of Flit's fingers, and we're deciding on what should we do next. Now, I'll tell you, the army looks fine. I, I think we could push on, unless this wilding horde is something incredible. I think we have the men to do it. Now, I'm looking at, we got Hornwood, that's one, two, three, four castles to take. I'm sure there's going to be a battle or two involved in that, but I think to go on the offensive is better. Now, let's remind myself, are we at war with them? Well, let's find out. House Bright Flame. We got a lot of lands. <laughs> Look at, oh my goodness. Um, all right. I do not see... Here's the Free Folk. No, we're not at war with the Free Folk, so that's probably... This is, this is probably best. I think this is what we should do. Let's make sure our cattle is following us, because that's our only source of food. Drive them onward. Let's just remind ourselves we've got a little bit of beef. Let's uh, go ahead and put our armor back on, make sure we're ready to go. There we go. Very nice. Um, hmm. All right. I think we're going to try to head back. We have to go back through Moat Kalen, head to Hornwood. I think that's the best thing to do. Now, one more thing I want to bring up before we move on is what is going on with our marriage? Remember, we're still waiting on the arbor for um, this wedding date. Yeah, you see? You'll have 307 days to finish this quest. We're still waiting on Lord Paxter Redwine to let us know when this feast is going to be held. I feel like he's just leading me along. All right, once we head back to the north, guys, I'm going to cut back and uh, see if we can figure out what's going on with the wildlings. This has been a hard journey. We ran out of food a long time ago. Oh, my goodness. I, I can't wait to get to White Harbor and see if we can buy something in the marketplace. We are desperate. Desperate. Oh, no. There's just three things to eat. That is, that is, okay, exquisite cheese. I'll buy that for 365 Anything to feed my men. All right. It's hard times right now. Hard times. Is there any village? Ah, okay. Let's see if we can buy some cattle. We're going to need it. Um, hmm. No food. Let's talk to the village elder. I'm going to take care of this really quickly. Come here. Come here, sir. Please tell me you have cattle. I will buy. That's enough. That's expensive cattle. But I think 25 will get us through some hard times. Alright. Now, on to pressing matters. We need to check out what the wildling situation is. So let's, let's head up this way and see what we're dealing with exactly. All right, here we go. Here's a wildling. 230 men. Ah, here we go. Ooh. They have rather large armies. Hmm. Oh, it's Torment Giant's Bane. We should probably... Uh-huh. You don't know me, but I'll tell you what, sir. I am a generous king. Um... Perhaps we could discuss something in private. Uh-huh. That's what I figured. Ah, yes, I know. You probably don't think anything of politics and kings and lords. Um, how do you feel about Mace? Oh, may he live. Okay. Well, unfortunately, I think we're going to go ahead and take out the Wildlands right now. 
I think we're going to start this war right now. Oh, it is just the king's army versus his. I don't think anybody joined us. That's perfectly fine. Let's take out the biggest man first. All right, let's go ahead and have our subscriber knights and Kingsguard follow here. This is going to be a pretty decent battle, actually. Get our infantry set up. Archers here. Half macers hold back. Let's set up there. We have not fought, fought this wildling horde just yet, so we need to be cautious to kind of see what they're going to do. I see them. There they are. Don't quite like the battleship we have, but we're going to get our men set up best we can. Infantry set in the shield wall. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Infantry. Forward, forward, forward. We have some horsemen. Alright, cavalry. Follow on me. We're going to go over to this left side, in fact. Infantry, hold back. Oh my gosh. Infantry! What are you doing? They are not listening. Oh my gosh. Unbelievable. Not exactly what I wanted to do. Wow, who hit me? That hurt. Alright, we finally got more cavalry coming in. Alright, it seems like with both of our forces doing a decent job. New enemies have arrived though. All right, I see, I see. It's definitely, definitely frantic up here. All right. All right, he's holding position, man. Let's, let's back up. Come here, come here, come here, man. Come, 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 come. Let's go, let's go. Let's get set up in a better spot. All right, here they come, here they come. Gallery. Here. Some cavalry. Go, 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 cavalry. Infantry, follow on me. Gotta come around this other side. If you get them, no way, sirs. Here we go. I have the infantry charging in. Oh, Sir Richard Lick is just upgraded. That's it. excellent. I think I saw James Lail also upgraded, so we're going to have to take care of that. Can't forget about that. All right, are we ready? Are we ready? Take on the last bit of this horde. All right, what do we have left? 31 men. Sneak this one in. Gotcha. A lot of them are running. Oh, you, you leave that night alone, sir. Oh, only my sword was. I don't think they've ever tasted Valerian steel before. Way too rich for them. All right, I think we've got one enemy left. We can see if we can clear out this area and try to take Hornwood today. That would be fantastic. Ah, <sighs> sip my tasty beverage. Mm-hmm. We lost a few men in that. That's fine. 
Oh, he escaped. Of course he did. Um, I'm not going to bother taking on any prisoners. Uh, but we'll get into the western building. Remember, we don't want to upgrade these guys into sergeants. We want to keep them where they are. But we'll take some more knights. And, uh, yeah. We'll take some more sellsword halberdiers. A little bit of upgrading. While we're down here. Ooh, veterans. Very good. Hopefully they can survive long enough to where we can, um... Take them back down south, remember, and retire them in King's Landing. Let them become gold cloaks. Yes, we have declared war. It's time. Kohor, please. Okay, so I believe I saw another one of these uh, free folk chieftains around here. But before we look for that, let's take care of Sir James Lale, the songbird. I believe my first subscriber knight. Um, let's talk to you about your skills. First subscriber knight on this series. Uh, let's see... Oh, well, I think we've been trying to make you just a beast again, sir. We've put so much into intelligence. Maybe it's time to continue put it into strength. Uh, let's see. Shield would be probably a good idea. Um, yes. Let's give you more shield. And uh, how about more pole arms? Because your one-handed weapon skill is looking fantastic. A little bit more two-handed. Perfect. All right, and now Sir Richard Lick, my subscriber knight from the north. Let's talk to you about your skills. 21 strength, amazing. Why don't we give you... How about if we gave you some intelligence? What could we do? More shield, more riding. I don't know if that's going to really, really help you now. Wow, look, he's got nothing down here. Sir, let's, let's round you out a little bit. Let's round you out. What if we gave you... Some. <laughs> oh. Why? Well, why are we even messing around? <laughs> why are we even messing around? Let's, let's give you more shield. And uh, two-handed weapons. Let's pump that up. All right. There we go. All right. Where is this other army? Would they even dare show their face around here? Got a mighty army behind us. We still got Sir Robin. Lord Robin now. Alright, I, th I think Wildling Berserk is 58. Hmm. I'm going to try to take in as much as my as many elite bowmen as I can. Hmm. I hate to sacrifice the knights. Can always get more sergeants though. So I'll bring them up. Yeah. Well, let's not forget Rainies. Rainies has returned. All right, let's do this. Let's see if we can take this really quickly. Surprise them. Building siege towers. I forgot. Oh, man. 54 hours. That changes things, doesn't it? That definitely changes things. Well, I wonder if we push further north towards the Dreadfort. I'd like to make more progress today. And I think it's too early in the war to start building siege towers. I, I Probably the Dreadfort siege towers do. Oh, here we go. Here's where they are. Alright, let's see if we can get a battle going. Seems like they're going to escape. That's fine. If you, if you let me take the Dreadfort. Aha! Ladders, my friend! A ladders. Alright, we're going to go ahead and build these ladders. Going to take five hours. And once we're done, I'm going to cut right back. See you guys in a second. We are ready to go. I can't wait. I don't think I've ever sieged the Dreadfort. Uh, this is probably something we talked about. Baylor and, and Darren. Oh, it is a beautiful sight indeed. Can I get our archers up here? Can I get my archers up here, please? All right. Oh, I think I like it. Let's see if we can get the infantry going in. Dragon Squaw. Forward, men. Forward. See if I... Do I see Sir Jury anywhere? Let's see if we get the knights following on me, Flame. Kingsguard. Where's my Kingsguard? I don't know if these archers are even doing anything. 
Do I need to get them closer? How about here? Dragon's Teeth? Rainies? Is this a better spot? Now this is going to be glorious. Glorious indeed. I can't wait. They're just letting us in. Is this going to be a trap? Are they going to skin us alive once we get inside there? All right. All right, here we go. Making our way. Without much opposition. Now they've held us up. I believe too many men have gotten inside there. All right, there's a little... Well, I think the bulk of them are right there. All 100 of them. All right, men. Keep streaming in. See, we've got some fossil ways here. That's good to see. Knights, move forward, please. Move forward. I think I see Sir Jury. Is he in the front? Is he killing? If he's killing... He's there. Oh, my goodness. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This is what I've been looking for. Here we go. Uh, let's bring the infantry in. I mean, the uh, archers in. Dragon's Teeth. If we can. Knight's Charge. Oh, yeah. Okay. Let's calm it down here. Let's get our old, uh, Coldbringer. Be careful, gotta be careful. Don't don't get in the middle of the battle, get on the edges of the battle. Okay. That's that's what I'm on. Okay. Right, let's look behind us. <laughs> Perfect timing. Oh my goodness. Um archers, I, you know I I can't put a better spot for you, sirs. I can't give you a better spot than this. Is that it? There's still 27 of them. There's some berserkers going crazy over there. Uh, I think the king's going to have to get involved. Wow, they're like holding up the whole line. Right, that bastard's tough. That bastard's tough as hell. All right, guys. <laughs> we took the dreadful. That was fun. I really love this that siege. That is fantastic. Ooh, let's see. Let's take a White Harbor Knight. Let's take all the, all the men um, on horseback. We can, and uh, we'll leave those prisoners. Some more knights. Anything good? Ooh, a few things worth taking. Ah, uh, we'll defer appointment, of course. Um, plunder the spoils. All right, guys. Let's see what the garrison's looking like. Ooh. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Sorry. Yeah, I know. Sometimes the king's going to be a bit of a bastard. We're just going to have to deal with it. Okay. Hmm. I think we need to drop some men off. Drop you off. Drop all these golden company guys. There's also a crossbow crossbowmen. Yeah, these new knights we just got. Why not? Keep you, sirs. That's right. Try to retire you retire you men. Oh, yeah. You, you go. Uh, we'll keep the Lannisport Spearmen because uh, they turn into those billmen. But that should give us a little bit better dread fort. Yes, defense. Okay, guys. So we split them in half. It seems like they're concentrating up here. Uh, maybe we can take Hornwood last. We'll keep pushing into Carhold, Last Hearth. And then we'll finish with Hornwood. We've got a lot to go. The Vale is large and going to be pretty tough. Uh, they have yet to face war. Of course, we've got Sister Ten and Little Sister and Long Sister, which is part of the Vale. So this is all one big conquest. But uh, we're looking pretty. What the hell just happened here? 
We've got a traitor down south, it looks like. Oh my goodness. We've got traitors down south. Alright, we're gonna have to take care of that. That is ridiculous. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Join the free folk. How dare they? Alright, guys. Well, let's take a look at the Dread Fort. Hmm. Ooh. Nice little dining hall. Not so bad. Now, let's go to the courtyard, right? Ah, yes. Who, who do we have? Edric Royston, James Lowe, and of course, Sir, Sir, Ian, Sir Ian Dane or Sir Ian, Sir Ian the Oculus. Ah, beautiful. I really like this castle, but we're definitely going to hand it out. But, um, no, wait, yes. Nice little entrance right here, up some steps. I'm going to check this out real quick. Oh, yeah, very nice indeed. This is very grand and imposing. I like it, sirs. All right, those Boltons kind of knew what they were doing when they were building castles. But guys, I want to thank you for joining me. I had a great time today. I I'm glad we made the decision to uh, take on the Free Folk and uh, try to just end this war in the North once and for all. But I have a question for you. Uh, we have yet to get the proposal for marriage. We've got the proposal, but yet we've yet to get the invitation for the feast from, from her father. And you know, I've had so much trouble getting married in this particular mod. You remember in my last series when we played as a lost descendant of the Rain House, um, we had the same issue. We couldn't get married. We'd waited for so long and it never happened. So you let me know in the, down in the comment section. Have you had as much trouble as I've had trying to get married in this game? Or has it just been a breeze for you? Let me know down in the comment section. Can't wait to hear what you guys have to say. Also, if you enjoyed this episode, make sure you hit that like button. You know it helps me out so much. Also, don't forget to hit that subscribe button to be updated on all the content on this channel. Again, I'll see you next time, guys. On the Clash of Kings. A throne for dragons.